Let's see if we can solve this Apex SOQL practice problem. It is a non-static method, so we'll need to make sure to return a value in here. Since we're using Apex, we can do inline SOQL statements. Let's select the fields that it's looking for. In this case, it's ID and name. Then we need to pick the table. So it's from students because that's the main table that we are working with. Now we need to filter down this query based on the requirements. So let's go ahead and add in our where clause and throw in the first filter criteria. Active is equal to true, email is null, or the phone number is equal to null. Now this isn't going to work because we're using an and with a compound or statement. So we need to wrap it inside of our parens and then finally order by the name. There you have it. We've knocked out this apex method.